All right, this is our radiometer, an archaic instrument used to measure flux. You'll notice I've removed the base just for convenience, so I'll store it in this little teacup right here. Our light source, which drives it, is an incandescent light bulb because it's very hot in the infrared spectrum. You'll start to notice it accelerating towards the black side. This is because the forces in it aren't actually based on absorption, but on heat differentials between the black and the white. So to prove this, I have my handy dandy heat gun. So the heat gun is a convective heater. It just uses hot air, no radiation, which means two things. First of all, the pressure inside here is going to greatly increase as it heats up. This thing will go to about 1000 Fahrenheit, so basically triple the internal pressure. And number two, it's going to diminish the heat differential because it's going to heat it all up uniformly, meaning that as it heats up, it's going to start to slow down because there's nothing to drive it. And now you'll notice, as the system reaches thermal equilibrium by heating, that it will slow down and come to a stop, even though the same amount of force is still being applied. Et voilà!